Hi, I'm Mike and today I want to show you how to make your sound very wide. Wide mix is better mix, so let's get started. You don't need any extra plugins, also I use Ableton, but I'm sure you can do the same thing in any DAW. First technique is called Hass effect. All you want to do is delay one of the channel, left or right. For example, this sample is mono and sounds like that. All you need to do is duplicate it, send one of them to the right, one to left. You can hear nothing happens, but if you delay one of this channel, if you can see a delay option in Ableton, you need to click here on little d. You can do the same thing with delay. Only what you need to do is add a delay, try with 100%, turn off the synchronization and delay one of the channel. Second technique is reverb. You probably know reverb, but... Ooh, no. Ooh, no. Sound much, much wider. Another great technique is Horus. Ooh, no. You can use it uh, together with reverb But the most powerful technique is duplicate your sounds and send them to the right and left channel and change something in one of them You can change a Q Add some plugins Change tone or pitch And also you can add them to the group and, and add a cue in mid side mode and add more side. And that's it, that's my favorite techniques to make sound wider. Let me know in the comments how you make your mix sounds wider. And also don't forget to subscribe my channel. See you next time.